large group of law enforcement officers got the attention of some Murphy homeowners this morning. They took over a home this morning in the 300 block of Oakhurst Drive in a raid that appears to be drug related. <laughs> Seventy-five police plus a SWAT team. It might be jail time. That's what they telling me. Lord knows I'm so tired of catching felonies. The thought of it all is gripping my soul. Trying to figure ways to get back back out on the road. A terrible feeling as I stare at my ceiling. Leonardo da Vinci paintings they so appealing. Lord, I need me some healing. I'm able and willing to put my cards on the table and stay away from dealing. Oh, Heavenly Father, don't let me be bothered. Please forgive me for my days of selling and robbing. I just want some peace. Lay on satin sheets. Photo shoots with Evelyn or her girl Shanice. Cause the real Casanova, they can't take that from me. Lord, know that boy hit that road of entry, a Dallas police SWAT team was seen assisting, along with Murphy police, to handle traffic. They referred me to the Drug Enforcement Administration for background, but none of the agencies, including the DEA, would comment on exactly what happened here and why. The real Casanova, they can't take that from me. Lord, know that boy, hit that road and make that money. Make that money. Truly, you're done in this Louis Vuitton. Every girl in the world say he cool as the fun. 300 and chain, what I put on that blame. Shift it home, sold it out, and we do it again. They making them statements to them federal age. Got me fighting this case while I'm still on probation. I'm walking that walk with the eyes of a hawk. A year ago, I had that ass laid out in that chow. I'm changing my ways, no more running them plays. Here today was one of multiple raids in connection with the Drug Enforcement Administration. Tell the judge Casanova know how to behave. How to behave. They gave red that time. G Bone got 29. Got events so upset. I sit here and just crying. Just some boys in the hood. We did what we could to put some food on the table just like a nigga should. I saw the police sweat. Um, asking for people to come out, out of the house, and then uh, we hear a boom. It is what it is when you handling that beast. Man, them folks don't give a damn about you and your kids. They raided my home, about eight in a month. Confiscated everything that my name was a bomb. A little while ago, a woman who's starting to come out of the front door now got out of the taxi and I asked her what was going on and she said that it wasn't her problem and that she wasn't going to talk about it. I never said a word, I just paid the bond. Let my lawyer talk to him cause I am not the one. I'm through with the game, these niggas is lame. When the going get tough, they just don't act the same. I'm feeling the breeze as I fall to my knees. Ask the Lord to help me get rid of this disease. When it fell in his end, when will it ever end? The devil knocking on the door, oh, don't you let him in. Uh, uh, Back here live, as you can see, uh, the young woman who just came out of the house is loading up into the taxi cab. They're still not wanting to talk to us about what went on here, but clearly she appears to be leaving. Uh, once again, whoever was picked up here this morning is, uh, and there's, uh, what their status is, is not a matter of public record at this time. As soon as things develop, but we can give you some things that we can confirm. We'll be back with more information. Live in Murphy, I'm Bud Gillette, CBS 11 News.